Hello YouTube and uh, welcome uh, to this video on how to avoid certain airspaces while creating flight plans in PFPX. So I uh, already uh, made a flight here from uh, London Heathrow to Dubai for uh, demonstrating uh, this. So uh, double click on it uh, you can see the Great Circle track takes us through uh, Syria and uh, uh, Iraqi airspace. Uh, but according to ASA um, those two airspaces, amongst others, are uh, prohibited uh, for European carriers to fly through. So, um, pressing random uh, payload here, quick find route. Uh, not my preferred way to do it, but uh, it's quick and easy right now. Um, you can see it still takes us through uh, Syria and Iraq, which we are not allowed to. So how do we change that? If you're already uh, doing it from in here, you can also go up and, and do it uh, from root and uh, create new and so on. But if you're already here, press edit and go up to uh, find advanced and uh, tick avoid airways, waypoints, navigates, subroutes and or if I ask you I ask as well and copy paste what I have already uh, posted in the description of this video you can see uh, the uh, ICAO uh, codes for um, some of the uh, fears that we are not allowed to fly in uh, for European Airlines um, or carriers um, it's uh, this one is um, Yemen airspace it's Baghdad. We have uh, actually this is uh, Cairo. Um, but if you look at the EASA um, directive for this, it only actually states that you cannot fly over the uh, uh, Sinai Peninsula and not actually the entire airspace. But I already included it in here, it makes it easier. Um, we have uh, Syria. Not Damascus over here. Uh, there's some for Ukraine, Pyongyang, uh, Mogadishu, and here are some airways within um, Israel airspace as well, or Tel Aviv. Anyway, once this is in here, we can go up and press. Uh, well, you can set this uh, to your likings, but go up and press Find, and you will see that it's now changing our route to avoid Damascus and Baghdad. You have to go in every time, as far as I know, uh, every time you uh, create a new uh, flight, uh, of course press apply here, every time you create a new flight you have to go in and press edit and, uh, uh, and find advanced and it's already there every time, just press find you just have to do it once. If you don't want to just create a flight right now you can also go into the uh, root database. Press new route. From uh, London again to Dubai, whatever. And now you can press find and advanced. And uh, put it in there. Now you're not really creating a route. You're just putting it in for um, for the next time you will be flying. Okay, that is it. That's rather easy. Thank you for watching.